one of the critical topic, critical report in payable application in implementation or supporting any type of project. What is the payable trial balance report? This report can use regularly or week basis or at a period in for reconciliation purpose or to know the outstanding. Payables trial balance report main objective to show the accounts payable outstanding amount or liability amount at BU level or OU level in the fusion or EBS. In fusion, we will assign the liability account at different levels, common option for payable procurement, supplier site assignment and invoice header level, you can control liability. Example as a double to one double zero as a outstanding. EBS, we can control financial option, supplier site invoice header. When I run the payable trial balance report, system will pick the only unpaid invoices, which is validated, accounted, and transferred to GL general entries only. When it comes to partially paid, I created a one lakh invoice installment. I paid 50,000. Remaining 50,000 will be shown as a partial paid invoices. And it will not consider saved invoices, hold invoices, unaccounted invoices, paid invoices. It will consider a debit memo, credit memo, even because the liability making the debit right, it will reduce positive minus negative. Remaining amount will show as a outstanding. So Oracle given the one of the important point, accounts payable trial balance report balance at month end, GL report trial balance report liability should be equivalent to make the reconciliation. There is a formula to consider the report. Last month trial balance, let us take example, last month trial balance, let us take 3 lakhs. Plus running month, you book the 1,50,000, means 4,50,000 minus you made it 2 lakhs payment. So 4,50,000, then 2,50,000 is the my outstanding amount in AP. That 2,50,000 should be equivalent to trial balance report. So Trial balance report works with the ledger basis with equal basis accounting. Let me go to run the trial balance report. Go to tools. Go to scheduled process. Then I will select from the drop down list. So we have the trial balance report in AP as well as the GL also. I am running payable trial balance report from Fusion Cloud application. EBS also you can use same logic. I am choosing this one. You can run the business unit wise. You can give the as and date. You can run from the vendor wise. You can run, run the, if you are using multiple liability accounts, you can use the liability account also. If you don't give it, then it will consider all liability accounts. Submit. I will go here. 
republish PDF. So here you can see 4,000 is the my outstanding amount from AP. So I will run the month end reconciliation time GL trial balance report. I will go here. I will take the same primary ledger. So I'm taking up to December. You want to take balancing segment here? Yeah. Submit. I have the like uh, ledger access with the uh, data access AP rules. I have the GL ledger access with the uh, GL rules. So I will go here, trial balance report. Here you can see the double two, one double two. I think I have some uh, restriction with the okay security rule for that liability account. I, I think that is the reason it is not showing here. So here it will show you can compare it. Okay. So the objective of the report to show the unpaid invoices as on date at organization level with the BU specific. We need to use as a period end activity, month end activity. And many times you will get the APTV if you are in supporting project. Many times you will get the APTV is not matched to GLTV. So we have to analyze the issues and uh, fix the issues in Test environment, test instance, move the, move the solution to production instance. Thank you, guys.